Hey everybody, Rick Dean of Handicapping Thoroughbred Racing from nearby Parks Racing, Ben Salem, Pennsylvania on Sunday, June the 5th. This is my day at the track.com race of the day. Let's take a look at race 5 this afternoon, folks. 2.43 p.m. Eastern Post Time. It's a mile test on the dirt track. Phillies and mares, three years old. An up race for an optional claiming prize of some $53,000. Contenders number one, Royal Jewelry. Number three, Cayman Croc. Number four, Primo Via. And number six, Busy, Busy, Busy. Number one, Royal Jewelry. Takes a class drop of five units. Has produced power run performances in each of her last five, including back-to-back power run wins in her third and fourth races back. Number three, Cayman Croc. Has hit the board in four of her last five outings, winning her third race back. Jockey Frankie Pennington spinning her arms on three previous occasions, hitting a board in each winning once back this afternoon here in Ben Salem for his fourth ride gunning for a second circle trip. Race 5 summary number 1, Royal Jewelry. Tops my contenders list today here at Parks, which also includes number 3, Cayman Croc, number 4, Primo Via, and number 6, Busy Busy Busy, 1346. In the fifth from Parks Racing. Sunday long shots, Emerald Downs, race six. The eight to one shot, number four, stay positive, better overall speeds, returning at six furlongs on the dirt, and the morning line favorite, number eight, Ducati. Mountaineer Park, Chester, West Virginia, race two, number three, Cactus Kid, a six to one shot. The overall speed leader in his climbing field has hit the board in power run fashion. Two of his last three starts. So handicapping from Parks Racing on a Sunday afternoon, repeat him for dayatthetrack.com, reminding you as always to please bet with your head, not over it.